Salutations, my brothers and sisters. It's Eternal Authenticity, broadcasting live. And I'm doing a video now. I'm outside. As you can see, we're sitting on the steps. Getting some sun. You know, normally I'd be out at the pool. But guess what? The pool is closed. It's been closed for like over two weeks now. I don't know what's up with it, but they said that they're working on it, on getting it back, like, you know, fixing it, whatever the problem was. So, it should be back open sometime soon, but you know, I like to sit out in the sun, you know, at the pool, get a good glow from the sunshine. But since it's closed, I just pull out my chair. I got a bungee chair. It's like, uh, it's pretty nice, you know, I just sit back in it, and, uh, yeah, that's that, but anyways, uh, okay, I heard somebody, but yeah, so anyways, I'm back on YouTube, and you know, I miss it. You know, like, I got some lady who actually reached out to me on Instagram. And she was saying it's good to know that I'm okay. You know, that nothing happened to me. And she was basically saying this because, uh, you know, I hadn't uploaded on YouTube for a long time. For about maybe 10 months. And... 10 or 11 months, something like that, since last year, you know, like, I started uploading <clears throat> right after I was released from jail. When I was released, then I was working out, I got some, uh, you know, supplements from the supplement store, workout supplements, for men, and I was doing good. I lost a good amount of weight, you know. Then I got down to probably like, I got back into how I looked back in my high school, you know, because I was doing sports. I was doing, I did football, I did PE, and I did a little bit of basketball before I switched over to football. But, uh, I was active and I was in different uh, programs and activities, extracurricular activities. So that was good. But, uh, you know, I was in a lot of programs and activities. So, like, um, my weight, you know, it was just. It was in shape, you know what I mean? Just like in shape. It's not like I had this like skinny, lean six pack or anything. No, I had a little belly, but it's not like I was obese or overweight, you know what I mean? It was just like healthy fat, you know what I mean? Even though I was eating meat and I wasn't as healthy though than I am now because I didn't have as many herbs that I do now and the knowledge that I have now. But back then, to now I'm probably pretty similar with build, body build, but like my skin is much clearer. I have a beard, a full beard now, and uh, yeah, I'm more sensitive, I'm more aware now, and yeah, that's that pretty much. But, uh, what else? But I'm getting back to how it was when I was uploading YouTube videos and sharing, you know, back in 2020, 2019, especially 2020, is when I was very lean, you know. I remember the woman who I was dating and uh, all of that, you know what I mean? And 
like I was much leaner. I had a nice six pack and everything. And it's all right, you know, I'm getting back to there. I'm actually fasting and I probably should start doing some sit-ups and working out, you know, I'm not gonna lie, you know, your boy hasn't been going to the gym for a little while, you know, partially because I'd be on the spiritual journey and I'd be like, well, there's no gym back in ancient Africa, the ancient jungles. You know, like, yeah, maybe use stones or rocks or logs or something. But you know, like, there was a lot of body weight exercises, calisthenics, and I've seen those guys out here on YouTube and Instagram. You know, some people I follow like Coop DC or even Chaco Bars, like, they usually do like mixed martial arts or body weight exercises and they're still in shape still lean still got muscle and they're vegan and that's kind of basically what i've done been more gravitating towards you know because i'm not trying to be big and bulky you know like that's what one of my friends was even saying like he wanted me to be big this and that i'm like well i know what you want and what your vision is but it, it's not my vision you know, so I'm not gonna follow it, you know? Like, I'm really inspired by Dr. Sebi and Dr. Sebi's son. Like, Dr. Sebi's son is in incredible shape. You know, he's very, very lean. You know, some people may say he's very skinny and the ignorant people may say he's skinny and they may not think much of it, but the people with their third eye open, those people that are awake, we know that, hey, he's very healthy. You know, he can fast for many days. He has all these herbs in his system. You know, he's healthy. He's healed many people, many diseases. So like, that's basically where I'm at. My third eye is open, you know. I sit on the sun, I meditate, I drink clean spring water, alkaline water, distilled water, you know. I'm eating vegan food. I'm meditating with the herbs, all types of herbs, you know, blowing that gas, that good ganja, you know, and I'm keeping things mellow. You know, I'm, I've learned too, not to let my anger get the best of me, you know, from my past. I have plenty of times in my past where I got out of control, you know, where I let my anger get the best of me and my emotions get the best of me and I, I wasted a lot of energy, you know, and I either got in trouble or I lost someone close to me. And it's not all my fault. You know, a lot of these people were bringing things out of me that were inside of me, you know. I wasn't really meant to be around these people but still, I got to see myself. And, you know, yeah. But anyways, I'm getting back to being a lot more lightweight. You know, I'm fasting, like I haven't been eating that much the past few days. You know, a few pears here, some watermelon, some strawberries, some pineapple, you know small stuff light stuff plant-based raw food stuff you know for the most part and i'm getting back to how i was you know like i think because i've been lean and i i have like proof of it like a video of myself where i was just like admiring how lean I was and how sexy I was and I still am sexy but you know like I uh, really have a new uh, understanding kind of because now I know that I was lean before then I can still be like that again and I think some people who never have been lean or smaller or have a six pack or whatever or been healthy 
you know, like they uh, may feel discouraged. They may feel like it's impossible to get lean, to have a six pack or to get, you know, and just because you have a six pack doesn't mean you're healthy. You know, there's plenty of people that eat toxic stuff and do toxic things and they may be real skinny or whatever, lean, but it doesn't mean they're healthy. Their quality of life isn't super serene or blissful, you know, or at peace, you know what I mean? So like, it's a different vibe, but still you can be lean and have a six pack and have a great quality of life and be, you know, plant-based, this and that. And that's what I'm doing, you know? I guess I'm really striving towards uh, getting this eye wash from Dr. Sebi's son. I'm gonna document that, share about that. You know, I've seen a lot of tests. What up, world? It's Eternal Authenticity, broadcasting live. I'm doing a video now, second part, part two of the other video. My phone went shut off because the temperature was too hot. You know, like I'm recording outside in nature and it's 100 degrees or so. So like the phone got too hot with that direct sunlight. But anyways, uh, like I was saying, I'm gonna get that eye wash from Dr. Sebi's son. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna get the eye wash from Dr. Sebi's son and it's gonna help me see again better. He's gonna get the mucus out of my eyes. You know, that's uh, what a lot of testimonials, like I was saying, I've seen a lot of testimonials on his products, especially for the eye wash, saying that people got the mucus out of their eyes and they don't need glasses anymore, that they're seeing again. So I have confidence that it will work for me. Uh, yeah, so I, I'm excited about getting that soon within the next few days, maybe some other... Uh, herb supplement you know and it's really gonna help out so i'm excited for that i'm excited about this weight loss journey you know i'm not even that big you know i'm under under 200 you know i'm six two six three something like that between six one and six three between six one and six three sorry about that uh just got a scam likely call as usual. I get so many scam likely calls. I don't even know. I don't even know how these people get my number. It's really annoying. I just go to it and I block their number. You know, like it's like get a life. You know what I mean? But anyways, between six one and six three that's how tall i am something like that who knows i could be taller i don't know i haven't checked my height in a while and my weight too last time i weighed myself i was like a couple pounds under 200 and i know i've lost weight so i'm probably 180 something 190 something could be even lighter than that i don't know but about to find out just losing the rest of the skinny fat you know this belly flab i'm fasting i feel the hunger in my belly but i'm gonna just juice you know what i mean i'm probably gonna walk to whole foods give me a smoothie you know do something like that but yeah i'm feeling good and you know i just want y'all to y'all authentic squad representing eternal authenticity for y'all to comment you know, show some love, some support. I'm back. Spread the message, share the message. And let me know of any topics or questions of discussion, topics of discussion or questions you have that I can discuss on Eternal Authenticity. At Eternal Authenticity on Instagram and also YouTube.com slash help make a difference. Comments, you know. I'm still a growing channel, so I respond to comments everywhere and questions. So hit me up. Y'all have a good day. Until next time, it's Eternal Authenticity broadcasting live.